Hi, Pisces. Third time over here. All right, Pisces. I've been calling you Scorpio for a long time now, okay? So I have to scratch those readings. Is Pisces. Right now, we're reading for Pisces. So Pisces, these are the cards that came out when I was saying the right sign, which is your sign, Pisces, okay? You guys could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Capricorn right now, okay? But um, you also could have it in your birth chart. Strong Capricorn placements or very, very, very strong Scorpio placements, or either a Scorpio has a strong message for you or something like that, all right? When I scrapped those other, the other readings, I was talking about the Magician. This is your main energy, Pisces, for the rest of the month, okay? Pisces, um, so you could be dealing with another Pisces, but I wanted to say Virgo and Gemini. That is the energies ruling that card. And then here we have Knight of Swords. So that's what I'm saying. Someone is very quick, to come in and talk to you guys okay they could be a capricorn don't have to be but they could be a capricorn or a pisces like yourself or a scorpio someone got strong scorpio placements i feel that um scorpios at play in someone's life right now even though you are a pisces you some of you guys could be taking on scorpio energy because that's when i'm feeling so hard and so strong in your reading okay because before i kept calling pisces scorpio so that's what i'm saying or either you guys have someone ready to talk to you or a, a scorpio wants to talk to you okay you have a will of fortune like i said before someone is having good luck or you know good fortune and someone is also having bad fortune okay and it's on both different ends of the spectrum to me that's what they're saying like it's just you know one up, one down, one this way, that way. Okay, so Will of Fortune, Sagittarius energy. I feel like this fortune of yours, good luck, good fortune is protected. Whatever is destined for you, your your destiny also is at play, Scorpio. Dang it. Okay, so um, <laughs> Pisces, your, your destiny is also at play. <laughs> I'm not scratching this. Your destiny is at play, Pisces, okay? It could be a play with a Scorpio or someone, your your soulmate or your um, twin flame. Take it as a apply. They could be a Scorpio. Someone is a Scorpio around you, Pisces, right now. Whoever they are, or if you haven't met them yet, you are going to be meeting a Scorpio. Know that for a fact. It's so bad. I keep saying Scorpio and it's Pisces reading. My apologies, okay? But anyway, the will is turning in your favor, Pisces. You're getting ready to get a lot of money. Some type of way, shape, or form. You work very hard for this. So congratulations. You may not even see this coming, okay? I do see, um, Pisces, that you manifested this. All right? With Virgo and Gemini energy here. And whatever it is, it is coming in fast. Did You do have someone coming in fast, too, as well. So you have an air energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. It can be. doesn't have to be. But it is showing air for the um, Knight of Swords. And then here we go. We have uh, Queen of Pentacles and the Devil card. Both Capricorn energy here. Can be Earth energy. Doesn't have to be. But it does represent Capricorn. So strong Capricorn. The will is turning in your favor. Uh, could be turning in your favor. Definitely for Capricorn as well. Okay. So we do have Pisces. So the will is turning in your favor, Pisces. But also a Capricorn that you know. Or that you're dating. Or that you're going to be paired up with in the future. Is, could definitely be a Capricorn or a Scorpio for sure. Yeah, Pisces energy here with the moon card can be, doesn't have to be. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And then that's what I'm saying. Someone is receiving um, bad um, karma right now. They may not even know that they're getting it or something that was hidden is, you know, they don't know. The moon card is upright. So it's letting me know that something is hidden and something is, is an illusion, just not real, okay? Um, there's someone is hiding a secret or something. Whoever's doing this hiding a secret, hiding an illusion or trying to keep someone in illusion or confusion or trying to keep someone stuck, okay? They're receiving back karma for it at the moment. Right now they're receiving it. Yeah, you know, Pisces Cancer, someone could also be a Cancer here. Yeah, okay, so, and this is all major arcana around the Queen of Pentacles. So someone could be Earth Energy, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. 
for Pisces, you could be a Pisces with Earth placements in your birth chart. If not, you are just money focused right now. If the will is turning in your favor financially, so there could be job, opportunity, prosperity, success, a lot of stability. So if things weren't stable in your life before Pisces, things are about to become stable now for you financially, okay? Because you have the will here, the will of fortune right next to the Queen of Pentacles, okay? And then you got all your major arcana surrounding you, okay? So it's the Wheel of Fortune, um, the Devil card, the Moon, and Justice. But they are being Pacific, letting me know that someone, one person is receiving good karma, which is the Wheel Upright, and another person is receiving bad karma. And you know, notice where the bad karma is, it's placed around this Moon energy. So something that was hidden, that someone didn't want it to get out, or they wanted to keep you in a confusion or a illusion state. It didn't work. All right. What is the messages for Pisces love? January 2023. Pisces love. I saw stable. All right. Pisces love. January 2023. Pisces love. Pisces love reading, please. Pisces love. Okay. Someone could be um, getting a divorce. All right, what is this? It says money's coming in the next 48 hours. We'll split this. We have Jupiter. Yeah, your luck is changing, Pisces. Whoever I'm connecting with, Jupiter, ninth house, Sagittarius, higher learning, temperance, a lot of Sagittarius energy, will of fortune. Again, it's already out. Beautiful, Pisces. You're doing excellent, okay? You guys got good money karma as well, okay, guys? Yeah, will of fortune, luck, fortune, prosperity, wealth, wealthy, rich, patient. Okay, that patient ties back to temperance energy. It's been a long time coming. Could have been manifesting a long time then, okay? Manifesting, it shows me right now. You're also in manifesting mode right now, Pisces, as we speak, okay? Venus, Libra, you guys could be bringing love to you. This is a love reading. So congratulations on that as well. That's why I'm saying Pisces, you guys are knocking the ball out the park. Seven house, partnership, express, hierophant, luxury, children, wealth, wealthy, abundant birth, new ideas, union, marriage, love, sex, affairs, belief, intuition. Okay, but yeah. Love is definitely coming towards you guys. You guys are manifesting it. Vanessa? However, it's spelled, I wrote it two ways. Okay. The name Vanessa receive. Maybe before it could have been a block in receiving money or something or getting money or money being drawn to you or coming to you. You're now going to receive it though. See, blessings from a past life. Okay. Loss. Someone is definitely trying to get out of the energy of being lost. It says quick sex. Big one. It says what? Can you handle me? So that's what this person is thinking right now. When they're thinking about you. Something about the color red. I'm also getting you're very powerful too. Okay, so this red ro rope over um, the magician. You're super powerful, Pisces, and you guys are always good like that, okay? You guys are very intuitive. You're Pisces, so um, you guys are just good. You guys are good at psychic, psychic abilities, all the sixth sense, you know, beyond the five senses. You guys are really excellent with that. And then manifestations, I see right here for you, Pisces. Very good. You guys are manifesting the life you want. Glam, glamorous, handsome. Or beautiful, okay? So a guy or a girl is handsome and, or a female is beautiful. It says, I did not mean to use you. I am so sorry. Gemini season. Drama baby mama. <laughs> is that keep coming out? <laughs> All right. So um, January, love for Pisces, January 2023. Is sex better with him? January. Oh my goodness. Um, head doctor, which is, again is, um, I'm relating it to um, intimacy. 
January 2023 for Pisces. Love. Red licorice. A choice. Okay, again, this fell out. It says money is coming in the next three hours. January 2023 for um, Pisces. Love. Again, red licorice. No way. So choice. A choice. Okay, a choice and love here. That's out. January 2023. Something new, please. For Pisces. Love. Okay, it's like this. All right, so we have panic. Cannot hide because I see you. The sun shows us all. Okay, so the sun is just illuminator. That's what we're seeing right there. Okay, that's what they're saying. They see, they see something. Okay, or you see something. Boo. Aunt or aunt. So someone's auntie. Okay. January 2023 for Pisces love. Oh, again, no way. So again, it's licorice and a choice. Pisces, please give me another uh, message. Pisces love for January 2023. Cheers. Okay, so we have 528 hertz. It says remove illness and disease balance both love and solar plexus okay so miracles clarity peace transport transformation dna repair toxicity removed usher in love and confidence someone is definitely healing right now someone could also be taking out time to heal heal at the moment someone is also like call me okay a lot of messages, Pisces. I knew it. I knew your reading is different right now. Pisces love, January 2023. Look at this. What is yes or no? Wrong or right? That's what I was talking about too. Okay. A choice. Again. Pisces. So you guys need to make a choice. It's very clear. Some kind of choice needs to be made. Again, red licorice. And then um, first house rulers. Okay. So Mars. Aries, self, appearance, the body, first impression, beginnings, attitude, identity, approach to life, consciousness, and ego. Okay, so someone is in their first house, which is Aries energy. One more for um, Aries. Why is that Aries? One more for Pisces, love. January 2023. Hold on. We have sleepless nights. This one back here says all curses reversed. Someone smells good or something smells good. Food, baking, you, cleaning, where you live, washing, car, or cooking. So any of these areas can be smelling good at the moment here. Let's see. Or this noticing, you noticing it. Okay, so Venus, Taurus, uh, second house, values, hierophant, belief, intuition, Taboo, marriage, higher IQ, wisdom, authority, love, sex, affairs, and unions. Okay. Hold on. It's all mixed up. It says, I cannot hide because I see you. The sun shows us all. I did put that up here. So a lot of repeating messages, Pisces. Okay, one more for Pisces. Love, January 2023. I shouldn't even say it again because I know they're doing it again for same thing again first house so all this is showing me pisces you guys could be living right now or resonating with the first house okay which is mars sign is aries okay so self-consciousness ego appearances the body you guys could be fixed on making yourself look beautiful or something like that or making yourself in a um, an appearance look a certain way and somebody is into red licorice if it's not you it's someone you're dealing with they really, really like it. They like it. <laughs> okay, they love it. <laughs> All right. Two jobs. Just, uh, what is this? Whistle. It's split right here. Two jobs. And then we have whistle. 
One more for the sign of Pisces love, January 2023. Yeah, same messages, uh, Pisces. Boo, so someone's going to come in fast, quick, unexpected. You're not going to see them coming. That's what I meant when I wrote that. And someone's aunt or aunties, okay? I don't know what that is, guys. Also, waddle in the back. So maybe these are numbers to play. 3, 7, 4, 11, 5, 8, 10. I don't know why I'm getting that. Then play these numbers on there. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Pisces. You see what I'm saying? It's so resonating um, with someone out there. I don't know who it is. Pisces uh, love January 2023. Pisces love January 2023. Ooh, it's, it's blank. There's just something you guys are not supposed to know. So right now, you guys could be coming here with, you know, you want to know something about love. It's pertaining to love. It's a love reading, Pisces. But there's something you're not going to know about love right now, okay? It's just not meant to, to know right now. That's all it is. Later on, you're going to probably know. But right now, you're not going to know in the, at this time right now, okay? So that's all I have for you, Pisces. I'm sorry for the repeat because we just did a lot of repeating there. Um, until next time, I hope you guys get a good message, you know, here or somewhere else. Till next time, take care, Pisces.